Hello, hello. Let's see if this will actually catch me. I'm probably going to be mostly quiet tonight, but how are you guys doing? I hope you've been doing well. Hello, Ninth King. I fucked up big time, but that booty. Oh, true. Pandora's fairs. <laughs> beautiful, beautiful. Uh, so. Follow Boy is distracting me, so this is going to be fun. Oh, before I start, uh, first off, I you already know that I've changed a lot of this, but uh, I added my coffee too, remember that, but also uh, tonight I ate on my YouTube. Uh, did I put that as a bot? I don't remember. Oh, thank you for the hip head chair. Well, hello, how's it going? I like how he shows up over there. It's like, what are you petting? Well. Monica and Angel, how are you guys doing? Welcome to the ASMR stream. Good, good. Yeah. I'm gonna try. The song is blaring in my ear and I love it, so I'm like low key getting distracted. It's great. That's great. <laughs> hey, dork. So, loser. How's it going? That's great. It's, it's like this weird mix of like chaotic ASMR. I bought a thing. What thing did you buy? Oh, so you guys are gonna hear that double because I didn't bother to, ah. <laughs> oh, ooh, what kind of car? Hold on. Jerry, you'll like this. Luna, don't lick, don't lick my hand. Hi, Luna. Hold on, Luna. Oh no, I realized the thing is on wrong. Is it not working? No, it's not working. It's not working today. Uh, well, that's why. Yeah, change the thing again. God damn it. Oh well. Let's see. Okay, we'll activate. There we go. Another witch is on Twitch. Hello, reviewer. How's it going? And yes, I am. This is my art and ASMR. How's it going? There is a cat right here. I need to fix it though. I guess, hold on. <gasps> I try. I won't be able to see it until I put it back, but how's it going? I just woke up, how about you? Oh, that's awesome. <laughs> I am doing pretty well. There we go. It is good. There we go. Luna Murder Street 9, no. Slowly realizing that I should, uh, why? Because I was unable to drop from class, so I'm failing, so I have to crunch. Oh, Jesus. I hope you'll be able to. Live on. In the mud. Yes. There we go. Oh, okay. F. Sadness. But, uh, yeah. Uh, but yeah, I'm doing good. Uh, I took a bit of a break due to some mental health, but I am definitely happy to be back and doing some ASMR stuff. Oh, okay. <laughs> Thanks, you guys. <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> Okay, <laughs> let me try to do that, but also, yes, <laughs> but yes, uh, we also have, if you want to switch up the music a bit, because we're going to be listening mostly mine, you can recommend uh, basically anything as long as you give me, like it could be YouTube, as long as you give me a link to it. I prefer Spotify, but yeah, that works too. 
also enjoy the noisiness. Okay, I'll add that to Q. has been added to queue. There we go. Oh. Yeah, I got a big kick the other day of just listening to Mania, because it's one of my favorite Fall Out Boy albums, so, e. Yeah. <laughs> uh -huh. And I have been meaning to make... See, so remember how last time I did this, I was working on... Where is it? <laughs> Shit, I don't remember what it was. I don't remember the name of it. This one. Oh, no, that's all it was. That's what it was called. This. I thought I did the same for another character of mine. Um, the only thing is I don't really have... She's the one I do my ASMR YouTube of. And I was like, you know what? Kind of needs a better, um, a better, uh, you know, picture. Because right now it's just like this background I made. It'd be kind of nice to have a, to have something nice or a little nicer. Although I do not think I am in. Oh no, I am. Oh, the opacity is low. What the hell? Must have been Luna. So, yeah, we're gonna be doing that today. Um. Yeah, that's all. Oh, I'm. So, two things. First of all, the 30 minute cat cam up ahead for the 550, that's wrong. We are actually at 500. Um, so I know I said I would be doing a 24 hour stream. That's not gonna happen that this week due to mental health. <laughs> You're shit Exactly. Um, but I'm gonna try to aim for next Friday to do it only because this week, obviously, we're having to play it by ear because of my mental health, so, you know, it'd be like that. Um, <laughs> thank you for the headpad share. Um, uh, so that'll be interesting. I'm planning to do some time, or do some things with it. I'm not sure if I'll stream Monday, Tuesday. I know I'll have to do it anyway for Thursday, but we'll see. But also Friday. I'm getting a PC coming in and it's a mini pc so it's gonna be i'm gonna be setting that up friday so friday stream should be pretty good i almost want to test it with something very heavy like dbd or hun i was seeing on purpose just happen e i just picked something where it said hit in it so yeah and yeah Talk shit. <laughs> i think nightbot is upset at unite king Think Nightbot is just like fuck you, Night King. <laughs> it's like you really fucked around and found out, huh? Memorial champions, nothing but dreams inside. I'm nothing but dreams. Lives young enough to still believe, still believe. I'm good enough not to know what to believe in I'm good enough not to know what to believe in Yeah I can live through this <laughs> Well, at least it got Emily, I guess That's good I'm gonna live through this I'm gonna live through it Yeah <laughs> 
imagine Nightbot is imagining them. And yet Nightbot is the entire, most of your enjoyment half the time. You hate Nightbot and yet you can never get enough of them. what most people would call a toxic relationship that I can't escape. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes. It's like just the one on the mod was active when it's still new. Oh, God. <sighs> All the blood's fucking quote. We'll see. Might have to change things, but that's like later. Oh, no. I've been meaning to actually work and fix this, but like, oh, I've been so busy with shit. It's crazy. Oh. Did I make this a vector? Oh, I think this is a vector layer. I am not playing 10 hours of crab rain. <laughs> I'm not streaming for 10 hours. Do that shit when I have to do 24 hours so I can get driven mad. <laughs> no. And no, I am not doing 10 hours of Big Blue Arthur or Jared. God damn it. do that. Love you more back then. It is a bop though, I will agree. It is a very good bop. to think to myself, did I do a good job on this? And then hate it. Ah, <sighs> uh, sure. That's close enough. Don't question it. Second only to the uwu rap. Alright, that uwu rap is a fucking banger, though. Yeah. 
next we have Wolf by Now Now. I'll start crap for him again. Why is this such a good loop? Because I'm like, I'm like trying to think where the end of it is, and then I'm like, alright, this is too good of a pop. <laughs> That's nuts, isn't it? <laughs> and I like how you come in with Scrabber too. <laughs> oh my god. I am gonna switch off Crab Rave when it gets to like the three minute mark. Oh, it is a three minute mark. What's wrong with your voice? Are you okay? Fuck yeah, crabs. It's ASMR. I, is that what I'm usually know when I do ASMR? Is I basically whisper into a mic? <laughs> I think that's how you do it, because that's what I'm basing this uh, YouTube channel of mine around. Fuck yeah, crabs. <laughs> so yeah, that's what we're doing. I lied, calves aren't the hottest, crabs are. You guys are so lucky that I, I didn't do a thing this year. Ooh, you're just super quiet, maybe. I think that's what it is. Um, I don't know if I can... Oh, I can accidentally just made it mute. But maybe that's a little better? Oh, yeah, because I'm a lot more quiet. I'm a lot more quieter than a uh, crab rave. Okay, that makes sense. Sorry about that. But, yeah. Oh, is there fracking here? Oh, there is. Damn it. No. That's fine. <laughs> I 
Guys, are we just gonna listen to this the entire time? Just nothing but crap, right? So thank you have you as a friend. Yes, get plenty of rest, Kim, and I'm so, I'm so thankful of having you as a friend, too. Yes, yeah, get plenty of sleep. We'll see you around. Like, fucking, poor animals evolved to be like crab. We're just, we're just better. Yeah, that was implying that I'm a crab. I mean, you know, it's either a crab or a crocodile. You'd have to choose. minutes of it <laughs> so we're gonna move on okay it is a bob is i unironically a fucking banger and i can't believe we've listened to six minutes of it <laughs> apex predator and apex prey yo fair Yeah, it's weird how that is, huh? <laughs> Bruh. Listen, I can't listen to 10 hours of it, so you're gonna have to deal with it. Oh my god, I was just wondering if... Okay, no, we're good. This is fine. We have become God itself. Ah, so you're gonna be a crab VTuber, I see. Yeah. It's funny though, because I have it turned up on my end, but I guess it's not. How's that? Is that better? I do have the mic closer to me now, so you can hear me and that, so hopefully. Crabs are better than crabs. Yes, better? Alright, sounds good. This is my favorite audio tree live session. Ooh. It sounds very pretty. Oh. Anyway, you watching Chainsaw Man? Not yet, not yet. I have heard of the hype, though. It's like... But I'm also that person who's like, I'll watch it when I can, but I'm more watching Spy X Family and, like, recently Castlevania 2, catching up on that. So, like, <laughs> I have so much anime I need to watch. But yes, I've heard the hype of Chainsaw Man. I hear it's super, super good. If him the months Muto Oh, is that what it's called for you? Hell yeah.
Maybe I should just swim. And now I'm like, how... What the fuck did I do with this again? Huh? Oh, yeah. The eyes are different though. Shit. Uh, you know what? Mm. Yeah, but, uh, Pibe, guy dude, is tr regional term from Argentina. Not the first time something like this has happened. Oh, okay. Non-point spoiler, the new episode gave us uh, this banger of a quote. As devils uh, go, she's down bad. <laughs> oh my god, that's awesome. That is actually hilarious. I love it. I know, my friend um, Naga, we played with him the other day. And, uh, like for uh, Dead by Daylight. And they've they fucking love uh, Chainsaw Man. And from all the hype I've heard, yeah, like I get. Actually, no, I want it like this. And then we'll do the highlight as that. We'll do it similar to like my eyes, even though the eyes are very different. Referring to a fox devil. <laughs> ah, I see, I see. Mm hmm. Yeah, no worries, Night King. We'll see you around. But, ah, I see, I see, okay. That's cool, no. But like I said, I'm pretty... Pretty behind, honestly. gonna be weird. I'm just gonna move it here. I'm gonna go sleep. Ew, uh, it feels so bad to say, but yeah, uh, that's cool as a bitch name. Ah, I see. Yeah, yeah, you need to get plenty of rest. Even though it is a bitch, uh, yeah, you still have to go to school. But yes, get plenty of sleep, Ninth King. We'll see you around. You might get my day. Oh no. Enjoy your daily dose of depression, Ninth King. <laughs> Goddamn. Yeah, that works. Guess I should also do this too. This explains so much. I'll fix that. I'll fix that. Later. I 
think uh, if I did that wrong. The many memories in the way of me. The girl on your heart is on the whole world me. I stuck my vision so inside. Get your daily, get your daily dose of depression. Beautiful. Yes, exactly. That's just what I imagine, uh, foul players. Oh, I gotta do my thing. I gotta do my daily game. Let me get my daily dose of a depression. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, hi, Maro. How's it going? How are you doing? Mm -hmm. Oh, I did not expect you to do that, Luna. Oh, how's it going, Maro? How's how are you, Luna? Do I have to take a mild break? Cause some critter is sitting on my tablet. <laughs> oh, thanks. Oh, hey, smart. Just drop on by and say hi. Hi. Yeah, no worries. All right, we'll feed her. What is your thing? Oh my god. Mm -hmm. I need. Start of my Thanksgiving break. Oh hell yeah! I know um, Mel's about to start their uh, Thanksgiving break soon too. They get off on Wednesday, which is awesome. But hell yeah! Have a nice rest of the night. Yeah, you too. You too, Maro. You too. Thanks, Jerry. <laughs> Very greatly appreciated. <laughs> and yeah, get plenty of rest. You probably need it. <laughs> Hang on. Hang on. Where are you going? Are you going back over there? Beautiful. <laughs> Don't think it needed to be that big, but that's fine. Thanks for that. <laughs> Thanks for the head pad. No. You just can have the zoomies? Okay. <laughs> uh the great. Working on stuff from home is great because she's just like, hey, so I'm going to have the zoomies in the middle of the day and uh, you can't stop me. And then she's like, here, 
for like five seconds. I turn around, she's gone. <laughs> I take a step closer, she's like, no. <laughs> I'm running. We zoom. Okay. No. The refracting here wasn't... At least on the skin, wasn't so bad. Is this even fixing anything? Don't think this is really fixing anything. We'll see. Sleep on every piece of us Something that comes out of you You want too many hits of this melody Need to come down We were lovers first, confidants, but never friends. We ever friends, but when your stitch comes loose, I wanna sleep on every piece of us and something that comes out of you. You I took too many hits off this memory. Need to calm down. Na -na 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 day goes by hold me tight hold me tight oh don't oh no 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 that's how it started yeah hold me tight hold me tight oh don't oh no Distance between us sharpens me like a knife. Oh, and we met. Distance between us sharpens me like a knife. Oh, no, 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 the day goes by. Oh, me tie. Oh, me tie. Oh, don't. Oh, no, 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 that this is how it started, yeah. Oh, me tie, me tie, oh, don't. 
there's like a few. Oh, there wasn't. Okay. That's fine. <laughs> I thought there was more fallout, but I guess that's all of the Mania, uh, album, which is fine. Although I find that weird and I really should double check. Yeah, no it is. She. I bought a Honda Civic Coupe, Honda Civic Coupe 2017. Ooh, hell yeah. That's not a bad little car. And that's what you got? That's awesome. Oh, I'm saving up for a car myself too, since it's like, finally, I kind of am in a place where I can say, hey, let me save up for something. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty cool. Ooh, this is actually pretty awesome. The only thing that I had refacking was, or at least the problem was this. I think that's just because it's a dark color. But that's awesome. Uh, it's so nice being able to, like, not have to worry about, like, public transportation. <laughs> uh, when I had uh, my first car, it was like, oh, so nice. I don't have to walk in minus 30. <laughs> But he. Yeah, you guys have pretty bad public transit. <sighs> Don't get me started on Edmonton public transit. It's <sighs> basically uh, it, the city planners for Edmonton are just monkeys that they threw pencils at and that's how they and that's how they made our like buses and everything it's like why don't get me started on the LRT don't get me started on the LRT especially since that is just a mess in of itself it's like why It's funny though because Vancouver actually has like probably the best public transit in Canada and then there's Calgary that I think is second I think it's a bit better and then my city is just like no <laughs> public transit we don't know her <laughs> or we know her we just don't know her well and we don't want to here is bad in a different way, but there's too many people and people go hanging from the bus. Oh, I've seen pictures of that. It's also as dangerous as you can get robbed. Ah, I feel like even like for my city too, it's like, yeah, there's a high potential of getting robbed, especially if you go to like a transit station at night. Like if I go to the, if I go to the bus stop, that's not too far from me. If I go to the bus stop, that's not too far from me. Like, that is... Ooh, I, I don't even want to think of going there at, like, this late at night. Well, it's not that late, but, like, when it's dark, it can just... Like, there's a high potential of getting, like, robbed or tailed. Or, it's... Ugh. But I'm also by, like, one of the more scarier transit stations. Then again, I say that, and I went through downtown and, like... 11 o'clock at night once and it was a uh, it was a bit horrifying I'm not gonna lie I was a little scared and it was after a uh, Oilers game a hockey game 
no surprise there. And I was a little worried because uh, there was like there were like several drunk guys, and I was just at the bus stop like, uh, ha, ha. but I made it home safely. Thankfully, there's like a few buses uh, there that get there, but like yeah, yeah, it's any public transit. Oh, Luna, why'd you do that? Hey. She just wants me to give her attention. Yeah, it's it's crazy. Music needs a bit less volume. Yeah, it's because it's a rock song. I think I'll turn it down on my end because I kind of need it to. <laughs> I think that's a bit better. Yeah, yeah, that's a bit better. Hi, Luna. What are you doing? Are you going back up there? Okay. Luna's having the zoomies today, and it's hilarious. <laughs> and now I need to show. what I see every time I try to work. She wants me to chase her. Because <laughs> that's what we do. Miss you. You're walking over. Hi. No work. Uh oh, it's lagging pretty badly right now. Let me just quickly do that and see if that fixes it. Luna, do you want me just? Pluses and minuses of working from home. One plus. I could be with Luna. One negative. <laughs> I get distracted easily with Kit. Look at her. Would you not also get distracted?
to you by the her. <laughs> She's staring at me like, what the hell is going on? What are you doing? Thanks for the head patch, eh? It's a good thing it's art today, so I could chase her around. <laughs> I can get distracted. And it would be good because, I mean, she's so cute. Sleepy girl. We have to move to news. I don't know. <laughs> this should be a cat stream. <laughs> Just me chasing around Luna. I was actually thinking of making it a um, cause I wanted the. Uh, so, I'm thinking of making the 24-hour stream, um, a mini like. I want it to at least be something more than just me being up for like 24 hours. So I was thinking making it also like a sub dash donothon. So then that way like, you know, it can be, uh, there can be a little more than just me torturing myself. Uh, and that was one of the things I was thinking of taking, uh, the redeems from last year, from last year's subathon. And uh, using that as kind of like the basis. Of course, I'm gonna talk to like Mel and Zombie Baby. How to do it? Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh, my god. <laughs> Divine, no, you. Hello, Mel. How's it going? Hold on. Getting distracted. Oh no! You're distracting me, Luna. Going after the window thing. ASMR heart stream? Yes, yes it is. I'm just gonna point the camera at her. <laughs> She's having the zoomies again, it's hilarious. Sweetest voice. Thank you. That works. Uh, I got the night and I'm loving them. A three Jennings is so good. Oh no. Oh my god. Uh, the critters. The critters having the absolute zoomies. Oh, so you got him. Ooh. Yeah, how is he handling? Did it. Is. Is today when he came out? I I didn't remember when the PTB was supposed to let up. I guess it's today, huh? Oh my god. Luna is literally not gonna let me do art. <laughs> He's great, yeah. <laughs> Finally, something where you can be like, yes. Oh my god. <laughs> she is just a full of the zoom today. New map is horrendous though, claustrophobic. Oh, yeah, I see. I kind of knew that would be the case when it first came, like when they were showing the PTB and I'm like, that's a very, very poorly designed, very poorly designed uh, map. Not like there hasn't been poorly designed maps before <laughs> RPD. Um, but 
It's funny, too, because behavior is in Quebec, and I know for sure there should be at least a few areas in that province to have, like, a good, like, perspective on what a medieval city would look like. Or a medieval town. It's like, please, come on. Are you kidding me? Or at least have some buildings from, like, you know, that could give you a better vision of it. But yeah, it's... Uh... I did see, though, that... Did you get the uh, skin that came out with it? Because I know there was, like, this really fancy skin uh, people were showing off. Uh, if this was for honor, that map would be cool, but man, it sucks. Yeah, and it's not. It seems like it's mostly just a, uh, I just got the silver plate skin. Oh, is that the base? I think that's the default, right? Because I know the legacy skin that comes with it is very shiny. Like, it's very, uh, glowy. It's cool. Me trying to do ASMR while also watching Cat Cam being like, Luna, what are you doing? <laughs> she also discovered today that she can steal the, uh, she can steal the, um, bathroom stopper because nobody here, uh, shirtless Giga Chad, though. <gasps> Wait, they gave him a shirtless skin? Did they give Ferturio a shirt like Please please say it ain't so Am I am I just gonna have to buy him for the shirtless daddy? Please Because mm, <laughs> glowing shirtless skin. Oh the skin is shirtless. Oh I didn't know that. Okay, I need to, I need to tell Jer, you just fucked Luna. No. I thought it was Viterio. But I mean, the knight's, knight's cool too. Also, in two minutes, the newest, uh... ASMR video on Sadie's channel. You made me bunker. <laughs> it's okay. For her, it's just gentle little bunks. Like, I will sometimes pat her head. There's also code to give you the charm for a behavior making fun of shirtless Felix. I'm about to turn this into a DBD stream, even though I know everything will die if I do. <laughs> so, oh my god. That's just amazing, though. Want to play it tomorrow? Oh, hell yeah. I, Because I, I don't think I have a lot of energy to do it tonight. We'll see how distracted and focused I get on this. But, like, I might do it later after stream because that's just amazing. <laughs> I can't believe behavior would make fun of the shirtless Felix. But like, that's great. ASMR is best for tonight. Uh-huh. Thank you. I'm doing my best. Oh, Mel, as a, as a thing, though, for the newest ASMR video, it doesn't have all the things you recommended yet, just because we weren't quite able to, um, me and my editor weren't quite able to do that yet, only because, um, so my editor has a premiere, and it was, it was not working for him this week, so he was able to get it done thankfully but yeah we can do a whole lot for it so also i have to still make the card and i also got um a gumroll page what is she doing <laughs> she's look she's looking out the window with her head upside down <laughs> it's a cookie 
You don't look crazy, girl. Mm. But yeah. Is your ego? You're so damn evil. Yeah, you women, uh, people, we want you. No, 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 no. I should just forget about you, but oh, oh. I have something that I'm dying to say. I don't want to any water dessert. You'll need to stay in all your favorite shirt. Anyway, all hey, oh, because it's a work in the world. Oh, we should the world. I'll never ever see you again Like you and all your friends You can all go to hell Driving the hearse on my boy no well And I wish you the worst And I wish you the worst You're worse One of the sorry One put it on your stage On your favorite shirt I am in pain Hope your car doesn't work Yeah, I wish you the worst Wish you the worst, and I'll never see you again. Yeah, fuck you and all your friends. But hell, I'll be driving the hearse, waiting a while, and I wish you the worst, and I wish you the worst. Lipstick on this one yet? No, I didn't. Shit. I did on that one. Okay. I'll try. Oof. Let's see. Can I do this properly? I don't know. I don't know what I'm thinking right now. I'm just like trying to think of how to do this properly.
She left. <laughs> I'll leave that there. Have to manually turn it on when she gets back, but you'd be like that sometimes. Yeah, can you tell I hardly looked at reference for the hands? Uh, oh well. If I just start, if I decide to start making more art, I guess, like of my characters and stuff, uh, I guess I'll have to look at more. But for right now, I was like, uh, <laughs> let's just do a cute little uh, thing so that the profile picture can actually look more flushed out. No, I'll thank you for the head pad chair. Also, <laughs> like what I made Cat Cam. <laughs> what I named Cat Cam. <laughs> I thought it would fit best. <laughs> I thought it would make more sense if I named it like that. Oh, oh, Jesus. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Option. Uh, there's ads and comment. Advertisement. It's so good. Like narcotics. I don't know. No nodded. To finish in college. Hey Jay, how's it going? How are you? Anyway, if they want help me, no shot. going decent. I'm getting over my flu finally. Ah, uh, that's good. That's good. Glad it was only just the flu, though. After a whole last week. I don't think that was a flu, but that's fine. Good. Glad you're getting over it, but I want, <laughs> I want my 5v5 against depression. Let's go. <laughs> How to defeat your depression, and also gain depression. Valorant. Valorant should take that as a tagline. Get to <laughs> get and defeat your depression with Valorant. <laughs> Beautiful. Well, all the symptoms line up with a stomach flu. Oh, I just. 
I shot the brush in the face. Beautiful. I just, I've never heard of, um, I've never heard of a stomach flu lasting a week, but then again, last time I got a flu was like years ago. So I can't quite say anything to that. Don't ask me what she's doing. I don't know. delete one and I don't let this one be it uh no why would I delete that that one's great all right thank you for some of my migraine stomach and muscle pain fatigue and loss of that ah my brother's girlfriend has it uh and he gave it to me and went through my entire house oh shit all right yeah that makes sense oh of course you shouldn't be surprised it is flu season so Why is it the monkey smiley face? That's so good. That's so stupid. But I'm glad you're feeling better, Jay. Either way. <laughs> Anyways, I just want to stop by. Yeah, no worries. I'm gonna head to bed. Sounds good. Yes, you get plenty of rest. Make sure to get liquids when you can. Got off work. I'm exhausted. Ah, I see. Quote depression is such a powerful sense. <laughs> it is. And yeah, night night. Have a good night. <sighs> Hi Ashley. How's it going? Thank you for bonking my cat. How dare you? See you around, Jay. Thanks for stopping by. Mm -hmm. Thank you for bonking my pussy bra. Why you say it like that? <laughs> I whispered that and Luna's like, huh? You're welcome. Huh? Pussy, cat, same thing. <laughs> no, but when you said that and I read it, Luna literally stopped licking herself like, what? Mm. I will not be surprised if this is a short stream today. That's fine. It'd be like that sometimes, so. Insomnia, job interviews, new clothes on leave from work. Oh. New jobs? Like, I'm just curious as to where, but hell yeah. Also, hell yeah on the new clothes. It's so great when you find clothes that are like fit you and fit you so well. Now you finish this, sir. What the fuck is that quote? Oh, I think that was the emote you usually use. Yeah. But that's awesome. That's awesome, Ashley. I'm proud. I hope those interviews go well for you. And if you're wondering why I'm whispering a whole lot, it is because it is ASMR. Let's go. Mm -hmm. I'm 
definitely doing this boop wrong. That's fine. Boops are never wrong. Beautiful. Parts distributor, um, customer service dispatch, law firms, not retail. Good, good. You deserve something better than that for sure. Unless it cause back pain. True. Because, mm -hmm. yeah, they were retail pain. <laughs> retail big pain. ASMR with a third of the stream dedicated crab rig. My depression in Val 4. And you know the funny part about that? All that still had to be in um in ASMR voice. So yeah, it'd be like that. Mm -hmm. How have you been? Um, pretty good. My hours at work have gotten more, um, but I also, I too also got some new clothes, which is nice. <laughs> and, yeah. Other than that, I really am, I am the lame adult. <laughs> I stream, I do work, and my work is all at home most of the time. So, there's not really much to say unless I have to go into the office. <laughs> so, yeah, it's a, it's a thing. You're the best. No, you, Mel. No, you. But yeah, so, here, I'm just vibing. You're that bitch, apparently. I am that bitch. I will always be that bitch. Depends on what kind of bitch that is. Because there are some bitches where it's like, I don't want to be that bitch. And then there are some bitches where I'm just like, yeah, I am that bitch. And I'm proud of it. So you're going to have to be a little more, uh, more specific. God, that's such a vibe. Oh, I will always be that bitch and I'm proud of it. <laughs> Listen. Like I said, this is probably going to be a bit of a short ASMR stream. Because I didn't realize until I started. I was like, oh. I do not have a lot of energy. Neat. I don't usually have a lot of energy. But I don't have a lot of energy. <laughs> so do not wrap your wrist. I could be a better boyfriend than him. And the shit that he never did. I'm on my own. I am every bitch that you don't want to be. So, like, are you saying, Ninth King, that you're a Karen? Or are you, like... Because, like, there's a, there's a good bitch, and then there's a bad bitch, and then there's a Karen bitch. And no, no one in their right mind wants to be the Karen bitch. Bad bitch? Yes. Casual bitch? I mean, it'd be like that sometimes. Like, <laughs> I am, in fact... A Kironi. <laughs> okay. That's like, that's like one of my fucking friends calling himself a Korean. Um, when he's Cree. I'm just a little bitch. <laughs> hey, we all start off somewhere. <laughs> you start off as a little bitch to grow into a big bitch. <laughs> yeah, but 
that dude was Cree, and he calls himself Cree, and I'm like, bruh. I don't think that's how you say it, but okay. We can all relate to that. Yes. Then again. So moving from bitches and bros and non-binary hoes are... <laughs> ah yes, ladies and gentlemen and those of us who know better. <laughs> Ah, uh, yes. Ara Arson. I will do my best to, like, construct melons. Arson. Sure, good fella. You only live one. Bruh. Man, states be wild. Mm -hmm. I don't know what I'm doing with this. Most true thing you said. I don't remember what I just said. <laughs> I might need a refresher. <laughs> Actually, to keep me from losing my mind. <laughs> I still need to finish this. It really only needs the antlers done, but I'm just like, fuck myself then. <laughs> burn out an orphanage, hell, you could even burn out Pandora's pussy. <laughs> Bruh. I mean, that's the least worst thing that be burning up her pussy. Wait. <laughs> Wait. But, like, I'm not wrong, by the way. Beautiful. Pandora's fast with a PhD, not the D. Bruh. PhD, hold the D. <laughs> Oh my god, is everybody seeing the new shit show? Pandosi. 
<laughs> exactly. Get the pen to see. Has everyone been seeing this shit show that is the new, uh, that's the new Pokemon? I fucking love it. Pen bussy. <laughs> Bruh. I'm making some questionable decisions here. And I'm not sure if that is the right way to go. But we'll see. There we go. That was just a bad mistake. Yeah, that works. I don't think Nintendo is capable of making a game that often. <laughs> It's such a shit show. It's oh my god, the new Pokemon is good, and I'm sick of, of pretending it's not. So here's something: two opinions clash. Here's the funny thing. So I played Nintendo since fourth gen, and you know I played the three D ones, I played the two D ones, and I played the two and a half D ones, and I just so. I, I did excuse, um, I did excuse Sword and Shield for, like, the wild area with, like, the PS2 trees, but, like, I'm watching, uh, Ray, if Ray Nervais Jr., aka was Brown Man, but he changed it, I, so I've been watching him play Pokemon, and it is the funnest, dis funnest, the funnest train wreck I've ever seen. The Legendary for Violet is just, it's just a chef, but still. You're not wrong. <laughs> but why does this train wreck look like something I could easily get lost in? Get so distracted in, never finish it, because I'd be doing 30,000 different things in that game. But not only that, damn balls and child, it literally is. But can we talk about why, who, who made the characters? And why did they decide to make all the everyone hot? Every NPC that you have to deal with. They're just like, so anyway, here's your teachers. They're hot as fuck. Violet and Scarlet's professors? Fucking. Oh my god. Why? A lot of the trainers that you have to fight, like the adult ones, they have muscle mommies. The hikers are muscle mommies. It's amazing. Why is everybody fuckable? They're leaning into rule 34. They see the furries. Oh my god, I seen the third Evo for uh, that. They've been doing that since 7 Gen. I know. The moment that they were like, hey, we're gonna make a more characters we need to make them iconic they're like how do we make them iconic we make them fuckable <laughs> that's why it's like oh my god please but like i was also watching a uh, zombie because she streams it um she's been streaming it on youtube and we were just like okay so our rival <laughs> one of our rivals uh, wants to be our girlfriend, uh, our other rival is just a romantic goth, um, and our mom wants to get on, or get with the director. Also, our parents are divorced, because of how, uh, because of the fucking villa they live in. And it's just like, damn. Damn. <laughs> but yeah, no, it's, it's a fucking train wreck. There are so many glitches. <laughs> like, like I said. I don't have the game, but watching another streamer play it, and like occasionally the camera will just clip through the ground. There's already been one of like the earthworm Pokemon, and instead of being in the ground, it's just in the wall. You can see it. It's still a step up from Shield, at least. It's not Control CV. Ah, <laughs> uh, it, it kind of is. It's just, it's that on a larger scale, is very much that on a larger, squ larger scale. It's like, oh, okay. But I do like that, like, you have so many challenges to do. 
and the only thing is it's not sliding scale, which would be nice, but because you can easily just accidentally walk onto Victory Road and get your ass kicked by a by a taxi driver, so <laughs> with like level 56 team, but I mean, that's the beauty of mostly open, uh, yeah. But yeah, it's a, I honestly think it's definitely a step up from Sword and Shield. Uh, definitely with like open world and Pokemon and everything, it's great. They just don't get enough time. Uh, it's only been 10 months from the last game. Nintendo 100% is on their dick. That is true. Like, I was surprised it was like Arceus. And then, hey, we're coming out with this other game. And it was like, with Gen 10, it's like, wait, hold on, what? So, like, there's a lot of things where, like, you know, they definitely had time to work on. And then there was, like, others where it was, like, this is very clearly a last-minute change. Have one single game in the new map. As killer or survivor? Because that just tells me it's a very survivor side map then. Which is fine, but, ugh. Also, Mel, <laughs> I found someone ha on a Pokemon Scarlet has I, you'll love their name their name on pokemon scarlet is pokemon i was like god damn it um arcos was also good uh graphics just need to be polished yeah yeah it really did huh i honestly i'm such a nerd for like regional variants and like the historic pokemon so like seeing like arceus being set uh in like uh fuck was it meiji period it was like great killer it's huge imagine the worst part of the dredges map but gigantic oh oh yeah so basically uh basically nobody gets a basically nobody enjoys the map got it that's kind of upsetting survivor side for sure ah, i see i see Also, Arcos has a 6x weakness to rock, so in the movie that he dies to a fucking rock falling on him makes sense. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I didn't know they made a movie of that, but yeah, that makes sense. Oh my god, I nerded so much when uh, they showed the Hisui Pokemon that were just like, like, previous, previous evolutions of like, these Pokemon who adapted and survived to become this and then changed over time. And I was like, yo, God died to <laughs> God's also gonna die to a Kerf or what is it called? Kreffel? God's gonna die to a fucking crab too in this new game. Fucking rock kill God. <laughs> Wait till God encounters a fucking crab. That shit's gonna tear him apart. Wait till God encounters the new uh, Quagsire. <laughs> He's gonna fucking die. But that eye is too big, and I'm just gonna have to deal with it. And Oh, we feel 
You find God, just throw him rock. Kill two gods with one pillow. Not even a rock, just a pebble. Yeah. Just throw D just throw Geodude at him. He's weak to rock, we might as well. Not even a rock, just a pebble. That's what she said. Not to you. Mm -hmm. Hey. Mm -hmm. no trust. Oh, shit. I didn't realize it's been two hours. Holy shit. Save. Not the taunts we love. I we forgot who we can trust. We move the world on. On the grounds where we feel safe. Crab. Yeah, did you not see the new crab rock Pokemon? He's kind of a doofus and I love him. No thoughts. Head completely fucking empty. It's great. Good shit. This makes somewhat sense. See how it be. Imagine a god level one versus weeping bell level 100. We have bell one shots, god. I have my point. The only thing though is, when in the games has Arceus ever, ever been level one? He's been at least, I think, level level 45 ish. He's he hasn't been that like level one the only way you can get him at level one is if you breed him and the fact that god is breedable <laughs> is not something oh wait no he's a legendary he's not breedable but that's the thing the only way to get a level one arceus is if you breed it that's saying that god has to be breedable God inbreedable. Beautiful. God inbreedable. You ever God inbreedable? I still have yet to see uh, You Can Breathe Legends with Ditto. Oh, okay. Of course, Ditto would be the ultimate breeder. That is literally the Pokemon you don't catch because you think it's viable. It's the Pokemon you catch because you're going to hoard off to your other Pokemon. And it's like you're either going to try to breed it with um something you want to make as a shiny. Or you're just going to breed legendary. Well, yeah, to do that too. Ditto is the hottest Pokemon. Think about it. I don't have to think about it. I already know. 
Because it could change everything, even base form. Okay, now we're just getting a little weird here. <laughs> Would you, may I ask, fuck a Grimer then? That's basically a thing, same thing, just toxic with burn your dick off. Yes. Why am I not surprised by that? Grimer be down dirty. Grimer is dirty. <laughs> Grimer's a poison type. Of course it is. I'd fuck any Pokemon. Don't at me, bruh. Mox fell backwards just saying. Ashley, I've known this since, like, Gen 1. Yes, I know it spells backwards. I guess, fine. <laughs> Thank you, Ninth King. Yes, totally. Thank you, Ninth King. Thank you for this wonderful ed education and, you know, muck being cum spelled backwards. Just like Ekans, a snake smelled backwards. And Arbok, just a K instead of a C. <sighs> yes, yes, yes. And now you got me thinking of that fucking big Vaporeon copy pasta. I still remember I almost got some baby to quote it. Because I said to her and she started reading it. She's, and her husband literally had to be like, wait, hold on, no, stop. <laughs> stop it. Imagine if Shiny Muck was white. Missed opportunity, honestly. Also... Also, another thing, where are the creepy encounting stuff? Like, so like, first gen had the white hand, which is a ghost hand in Lavender Town. I think it was Lavender Town, where um, you can occasionally find like this white hand just touching someone. And I remember somebody made a kind of like a ROM or like a XC based on that, like a Creepy Pasta Pokemon XC based on that. But one of the NPCs talks about this like ghost hand and they're like, Oh, that's not your Pokemon? Okay. Uh oh my god. <sighs> Bruh. Bruh. <sighs> yeah, yeah, that one. But um what was I thinking there? Oh, and like, I remember Gen 5, was it Gen 6? Gen 6. Um, because I think it was, it was the Hex Maniac, where you go into the office building, and then you just encounter this strange-ass ghost. And it's like, oh. And she has no explanation, she has no reason for being there. She just shows up, slides in, like literally. She doesn't have a walkimation or animation or anything. And she's just like, you're not the one. And then leaves. Not gonna lie, uh, Gordivore is more breedable than Vaporeon. That's because it looks more like a human man or woman than Vaporeon. The guy who made the Vaporeon copy pasta very clearly took the time to research because I'm assuming he really hopes that this was a thing.
This chat is cursed. <laughs> Ashley, you should be glad it's cursed this time. Last time I did an ASMR art stream for a good hour. It was nothing but politics. And even worse, it was American politics. And I'm sitting here trying to facilitate that being like, okay, as an outsider, as a Canadian, let me just say, you're shit whack. <laughs> but yeah, so, Vaporeon is a large dog. That being said, I'm a furry for Pokemon. No, it's just me. Um, considering what I've seen for the Pokemon fan base, you're not alone. And also, let's be real, I'm kind of not surprised Pokemon leans into the fur bait every so often. I mean, look at Lil Bunny, look at uh, Lucario, look at basically any Pokemon that stands up. And all of a sudden we have people who just want to fuck it. It's like, okay. I'm the only cursed man that's chat Lakari was my favorite book of mine. <laughs> uh, I mean Pog, I guess. I mean go for it, you do you. Listen, I'm not gonna judge. I'm not gonna judge. I am gonna bring up though my favorite Pokemon is Umbreon, so like call me an edgy bitch all you want. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. Yours is Jolteon. Yours has more edges than mine. I said Lucario is my fave and you think I want to fuck it? Well, yes, that's true. Y yeah. Why do you think I didn't question it? We all know what it means when somebody says their favorite is Lucario. It's like if somebody says their favorite is Lopunny. We all know why. And especially if it's Gardevoir too. Yeah, we all know why you like it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I hear you saying I will break the chain Don't love me now You will never love me again And still hear you saying I will break the chain But also, I was super excited to see that, uh, the newest Pokemon game- Oh, she's stretching her feeties! Oh, oh, the baby. Uh, Lopunny, Umbreon, Gardevoir, Lucario are my fave, and all of them for the same reason. <laughs> I don't know how I feel that you put Umbreon in the reason of, I want to fuck him. <laughs> but, okay. Although... Although, I do remember one of the books in uh, one of the libraries in the older Pokemon games literally said people used to fuck Pokemon. So, like, is that just Pokemon admitting that, like, is this Nintendo admitting that they know that people are going to be like, yeah, we want to fuck the Pokemon? Or is this, like, Nintendo being like, yeah, no, this is real. You will not be shamed by us for this. Like, I have questions and comments and slight concerns, but you know, it'd be like that sometimes. 
He has to do another turn. <sighs> Huck up a Pokemon while the maximum temperature is like too much for most. They're capable of controlling it. So they can set themselves at the perfect temperature for you. That is wholesome as shit. I love it. You know, for a random thing I wanted to do with Luna, I, like as like a little costume for her, I made a sandwich. Hell yeah! Is it a good feeling sandwich that you deserve? Um, so for like a little costume thing I wanted to do with Luna, I wanted to, um, I wanted to make like the little circles for like Umbreon. <laughs> or, um... Oh, hi. I was gonna say, has the queen decided to bless us? Um, I wanted to, yeah, so like make like either a little, uh, umbrella, like a little circle thing on her. I did not realize it was that far back. Chicken sandwich. Ooh, yeah, that's a good sandwich. It's a very good sandwich. Uh, along with that, they have, <laughs> oh my god. Ah, uh, so all oh, they have. So the fence, uh, which means that they're more likely to be very calm and resistant to emotional damage. So this, you ha if you have a big day, you can vent to it while hugging it, and it won't mind. Oh, that is wholesome as hell. It's like reasons, f <laughs> reasons Flareon is vital because it is a therapy Pokemon. Enjoy the cam. Mm -hmm. I will not leave alone in my eye alone Make you feel like it's not too late It's never too late Even if I say It'll be alright I'll hear you say You will end your life Look at those feeties Look at them They are Maybe we'll turn it around cause it's not too late, it's never too late No one will ever see the sight reflected And if there's something wrong, who would have guessed it? And I... So anyway, make a little punny and don't mean mommy and I'm all for it, back to curse. <laughs> Alright, fair enough. No. It's never too late Even if I say It'll be alright Still I hear you say You will end your life And again we try To just stay alive Maybe we'll turn it around Cause it's not too late It's never too late We won't come back I will not give you that <laughs> What the fuck? <laughs> what the absolute fuck? <laughs> oh, you good Luna Dragon air No, wait, that is Drogon Droganor Who is Dro- who is Droganor? Who is Droganor? Like, is that like the black and white crime fighting Pokemon? Dragon Noir? Drogan Noir? I hear you say you want to Don't have your ears back like that, Luna. We try to just stay alive. Maybe we'll turn it around cause it's not too late. It's never too late Maybe we'll turn it around Cause it's not too late It's never too late Dragon air, fuck <laughs> Fuck you, I have a speech impediment Um If you were talking, yes Then I would forgive that Uh, but you're typing, my dude Either you're extremely dyslexic Or you don't know how to Save your life. 
Blood, hi, hello. <laughs> hello, hello, Raiders. Welcome, welcome. My name is Rin. I'm your cute Midwest Lunar Witch, and tonight we're doing some ASMR and art. How are you doing, Blood? How was your stream? Huh? Oh. Aw, thank you for the follow. Ooh, some good tunes. Yes. I always uh, play some... I at least try to play my, uh, you know, my Spotify while I do this. Hold on, let me show you a blood. Luna's... Luna is hitting something on my tablet. Hi, nice to meet you. How are you doing? I'm doing good. How are you? How's your day there, Egg? And thank you for the follow. I had to move my tablet out from my cat's booty. Let's hope this works. Don't forget about talking about Bonking Boy Come on. <laughs> Okay, that's mainly Ninth King. I was just gushing over how the new uh, kitty, yes. Her name is Luna. I'm trying to do some art. Okay, I'm leaving. I should have been sleeping an hour ago. Yeah, that's your fault. The moment we tar started talking about Pokemon, you're like, this is a Pokemon. Here's my list of Pokemon. I want to fuck. Ooh, Scarlet Nexus. How is that going? Kitty, yes. Her name is uh, Luna. I'm trying to show her properly, but... Wait, hold on. Maybe if I do this... Kitty. Kitty. Okay, just testing out some things. Oh, hell yeah. Kitty. <laughs> Kitty. Poconut November, bro. Uh, but yeah, so we're talking about uh, music and bands. While well, I got up to some fun Scarlet Nexus. First playthrough, Ren. Ooh. What's Scarlet Nexus? I've never seen it. I've never heard of it before. It sounds cool, though. Mmm. -hmm. But yes, if you're wondering who this cutie is, this is Luna. <laughs> my little catto, my familiar. The little gif beside me is uh, her mascot diva form. This is her safer human, safer human form. Because if she showed her Eldritch form, I don't think anyone would be surviving right now. <laughs> And yes, did I give my cat VTuber lore? I did. <laughs> Pokemon November is a real thing. You randomize a Pokemon in that too. I don't ask how I know. I'm traumatized. That doesn't sound like someone who is traumatized by that. It's done by the same devs as Code Vein, but it is uh, about uh, psionics fighting entities that are bent on eating brains but are not zombies. Oh! Oh. Sounds horrifying, but it also sounds really cool. I'll have to check it out sometime. Shh, but I was gonna say, aren't you supposed to, aren't you supposed to be in bed too? But also, bruh. Won my last game of 4K. Oh, congratulations, Mel! Hell yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, the newest video, um, ASMR video just came out uh, about an hour ago, but yeah, it's morning cuddles, so please feel free to watch. Yeah, Mel's playing the uh, new killer in DVD, which is the. Uh, we're just gonna ignore the feet because I'm not good at feet, and it's gonna be more focused on here. So, so we're not gonna worry about that. Mm 
literally just like to add a bit to my book. <laughs> oh, thank you, Mel. Uh, yeah, my comic about two serial killers in love could work well, but if I wrote a book about three lesbian lovers who form a polycule and adopt five cats and live in their college home, I would read the shit out of that because that would be cute as fuck. That would be adorable. And and can they have like a little story on how they did up like each of their cats? Cause that'd be great and saddening because like, you know, backstories. And I did sing one tune during the stream, courtesy of the song Mode Redeem, Creep by Radiohead. Ooh, that is a good song. That's such a good song. A while since I've listened to Radiohead. Yes, exactly, see? Do it. Well, yeah, you can you can write about serial killers and love and all that shit. Yeah, whatever. Uh, but like, why be straight when you can go gay? <laughs> you know? <laughs> why write a straight story when you can have them be gay? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I am a love. We were at the star. What gay lesbian serial killer poly kill? One of them? One of them has to be the cleanup crew. Egg Rin is a fun streamer that gets up to DVD Danganronpa. I know I butchered the spelling. Actually, no, you spelled it right. You actually spelled it right, blood. <laughs> as well as some occasional shipwrecking in Sea of Thieves. So I've been doing a lot of Sea of Thieves with uh, Delitzer. Um, on, uh, or well, I was playing with him on Saturday. And I've been doing, as well as Art and Terror readings. <laughs> I do my best. <laughs> it is funny though. I was surprised that last time I did this, uh, people were like, yeah, you should do more uh, ASMR and art. And I was like, okay, we'll see how it goes. <laughs> mm -hmm. On the of the mind, it was your heart on the line. Really fucked it up this time. Deny my dear. Told you people love you. <laughs> I mean, I don't, I mean, that's fair, <laughs> but just, my mind dear, my mind dear, shush, <laughs> shush, Are you attacking my cursor, Luna? You cutie. Though at the same time, we also give friend play occasions for shut the fuck up. <laughs> yeah, but the moment you drop a pun, it's just like, God damn it, shut the fuck up. Nam does a wholesome one where it's just like, hey, love you, adorable, and all that shit. It's just like, shut the fuck up. <laughs> Mm. No, I'm not Sundre. Mm. 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 your fault but mine? Your heart on the mine? It's like the <laughs> usually. <laughs> I think there's only one time where I think it was like a serious like shut the fuck up but like I think only Jer would remember that just somebody who was like gonna test me and I was like being a Sundari would imply that she liked us to begin with <laughs> Damn it, 
shit, now I can't confirm or deny that. Actually, <laughs> shut the fuck up. Luna, I just need your cute face and shot. Because it is very cute. Don't steal my chocolates. <laughs> They're not for you. <laughs> you know your cat is soft and chunky when <laughs> you could just casually push on her and she just like she jiggles tickle 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 <laughs> my mirror <laughs> what? Why are you looking at me like that? Though even if Kitty wasn't, uh, they would pop down the same way. True. Oh, where are you going? <laughs> oh. True. But she's just very squishy. And I like that. I think she's also been a little upset because it's been cooler today. And uh, she wants to really, like, cuddle me. So it's like, oh, I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. Are you finding yourself better uh, situated place room? Uh, I've been meaning to ask that for a bit. Uh, yeah. It hasn't been too bad, actually. Um, I think the only issue really has been, um, just some plumbing stuff, like, <laughs> old appliances and stuff, but other than that, neighborhood's actually not too bad. I mean, I did see a dumpster fire, um, at, like, two in the morning, but that was only once, so that was good. <laughs> but, yeah, it hasn't been too bad. And Luna likes it because she has a lot more places to run around, and <laughs> she loves the carpet, uh, and also the, uh, our back alley area, a dumpster fire, it, an actual dumpster fire. I have, I have pictures. <laughs> I have pictures. <laughs> I woke up to, um, it was two o'clock and I was about to go to bed and I woke up to, uh, I was like, why, why do I see flashing lights? And I looked out and yeah, sorry about that. You weren't supposed to see me. <laughs> Ashley, you saying that, and I just imagine you standing out in, like, the darkness behind my apartment, like, being a fucking, being a fucking gremlin, like, yes, we're, I am here, probably sneaking off to Bailey's, but we're here, but, like, Luna likes it because she gets to have a lot of, uh, she gets to have a better view of, uh, like, there's trees, there's birds, uh, the little kids upstairs, uh, when they go and, like, when they go to, like, shopping or outside to play, uh, they'll always come to the window and they'll be like, ooh, look at the shadow, and Luna loves it. So 
so Luna's and it was funny too because the other day uh when I was coming home from the rare time I go to the office she was sitting at the window and like all you see is eyes like her eyes and like the insides of her ears and if you didn't see the inside of her ears you would be like there is something staring out at me and I don't know what it is but no it was just Luna looking outside and I was like oh cute <laughs> but yes she's like a little I guess you could say she's like a little celebrity Mm -hmm. I'm kind of interested in how you would enjoy Stray. Um, I wouldn't mind it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I do know that there are some mods to make the cat like a black cat, so obviously I'd be doing that. But if the cat gets hurt, I'm going to be so upset. <laughs> YouTube recommended me a video called Five Signs You Have ADHD and Autism, and I feel incredibly called out. Ah, uh, yes. The video that gets people to be like, oh shit, maybe I am this. Considering that you can do many cat things in it, like knocking, thing knocking off things, <laughs> I'm already pretty much a cat. <laughs> I mean, if you think about it. I, if I think about it, I'm like, yeah, I'm pretty much a cat. But, yeah. <laughs> Actually, I should make a bit... And you can scratch on the ground walls too. <laughs> Hell yeah. I get to do Luna Simulator. <laughs> Where I just scratch furniture and scratch walls. Can I also bust open doors with all my weight despite the fact that they were already slightly open to begin with? <laughs> Yeah, Luna has like a, um, not to mention also walking uh, between legs to cause falls. <laughs> that sounds awesome. Yeah, Luna has this like, um, this like policy, like open door policy where like you have to have the doors open or she will just like, she will claw at them. She will just push them wide open. So she doesn't like it when doors are closed um, near her. Or around her um especially like for me so if i uh if i close like the bathroom door she'll be immediately at the bathroom like hey let me in scratch 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 hey let me in hey let me in and i'm just like oh god <laughs> and then there'll be times where I'll, like i'll get out of the shower and the bathroom door is like wide open <laughs> and you see luna <laughs> you see luna sitting at like sitting beside the door in the hallway acting like oh i didn't do this no no but also i should protect you while you're in the shower and i'm like luna <laughs> but yeah. 
that's also because she's so used to like when I first brought her home she didn't have to worry about that because I left alone but you know some people would like their privacy and not have a little black cat be like hey what's up <laughs> can I join you <laughs> but yeah Thinking about doors to oh, get attention. That sounds accurate. That sounds so accurate. I don't know if this purple is working. I guess it's working. Okay, let me see if I can. Let me see if I can find that blood. Uh. Yeah, I can't find beautiful, but... Oh, there it is. Let me see if I can find um, the other one. Yeah, I was only able to find this one, but it's all good.
I know I have to erase it, so I'll just do that. Oh, wait, no. I fucked up. Because there was already that. Oh, no. Christopher Hall's voice is still distinct. It was first the frontman of Stabbing Westward, then joining the Dreaming while SW was disbanded. Ah. They finally returned to SW recently when they got back together. Oh. Okay. Yeah, it's kind of like um, the main, uh, the lead singer of Three Days Grace. Um when his voice is so distinct that when he left the band um i forget why but he left the band and it just it was never the same i think he's in oh, i forget the name of the band that he's in right now i've been meaning to listen to some of them or listen to more of their songs but i don't know classic three days grace to me is just can't get enough of it. Just can't get enough. First, it was health related, and then other issues. I think their manager and he's currently with Saint Asonia, uh, loving what they get up to. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. I remember hearing one of them, and I was like, wait, like, because I didn't realize, um, because I hadn't listened to Three Days Grace for years when I heard it, when I heard, uh, when I figured this out. But like, I, I heard like one of those Saint Asonia songs. I was like, wait. I recognize that voice. That's the main singer. That's the lead singer of Three Days Grace. And then I asked a friend who's like super into music. And he said to me that, um, yeah, so they split. The lead, the new lead singer is, they're not bad. They're definitely trying to be close to it. But, yeah, I don't know. I guess to me it's just like, ah. Not the same, but yeah, I need to see health and other issues with the... Okay, I thought it was... I thought... Oh, no, 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 that's Panic, never mind. Panic was with the band members. Um, yeah, if it was something to do with her manager, that makes sense. Because, you know, managers can be a pain like that. I don't know why I was thinking of when um, Brendan Yuri took over Panic, because all his band, like all the band members basically chose to like leave either because they had kids or they just weren't interested in doing music into doing the band anymore you know stuff like that but because the band was so iconic and his voice is so iconic to the band he chose to keep it he chose to stay under um that name under panic at the disco because it just it was too iconic and he like, he still wanted to make music and he didn't want to do a whole you know do the whole solo thing. He was just like, fuck it. I'm, I'm panic. I'm the face of panic. <laughs> this is good. But yeah. Um, and the new guy for Three Days Grace. They're the front man for My Darkest Days. The man's, but the vocalist isn't uh, the best fit for Three Days Grace. Yeah. He, like when I heard him, it, the song I heard him from, I was like, okay, it's not too bad, but it's definitely like bootleg three days grace <laughs> no 
no shade to the guy, but like, yeah, he's just, he's just not, the one guy's, Christopher, was it Christopher? No, not Christopher, the other guy for Three Days Grace, the main guy, like, his voice is just so iconic, like, yeah. A bootleg of a bootleg of three days. Oh, is this a new one? Do they have a new uh, guy for it? Have they went through uh, two singers now? Oh, that's not good. That's not good if they went to went through uh, two singers. Uh, Adam Gontier's voice is hard to replace. Yes, it it very much is. Because his voice is so iconic. No, I'm just saying that the vocalist they have now um, is of that. Yeah, yeah. No, I didn't. I oh, know. I just. Yeah, you never know, cause like. I don't know. It's one of those things where it's like, oh shit, but. Hmm. I I'm a bit tired now um which is fine so I'm gonna stop it here today um but thank you guys so much for uh watching thank you blood for the raid uh thank you egg and kim for the follow and subs um I will so tomorrow is my day off um but I will be back Thursday for probably, it might be TBD, it might be Hunt, I'm not sure, I forgot to ask the other two, but it'll be what it be. Um, thanks for streaming, thanks for being here, Blood, and thank you for the raid. Um, also, uh, so I know I did say for 500 I would do a 24-hour uh, stream. I'm planning to do that next week, since I have a new PC coming in on Friday. Thank you for the amazing stream, you have an amazing video. Oh, thank you, Mel. Me and them, me and Ricky are trying our best, <laughs> but I appreciate it. And yes, um, won't be streaming Thursday. Oh, I guess you just want to have your time off, which is totally fine. I'll ask about later. Right now, I'm like, brain talk, think what? <laughs> Thanksgiving. Oh, right, Thanksgiving. Right, right. Um. Well, I'll be back Thursday because it's not uh, Thanksgiving for me, so. <laughs> I hope you guys have a rest of your, a good rest of your day, evening, or night. Um, and I will see you all on Thursday. I'm just going to see maybe if, uh, maybe read? Oh, yeah, but a 24-hour stream. I want to try to do it for next Friday. So then that way I have both my, uh, my PC and everything up and ready to go. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, you know what? Speaking of TBD, let's raid uh, a fellow cutie. Which is Danny. Been a while. I used Unraid. Oh, did I exit out of it? Is that what happens? No, shit. <laughs> Shit, no. Anyway, I hope you guys have a great rest of your day, evening, or night. Say hello to Danny for me, and I will see you all on Thursday. <laughs>